hello and welcome back to the channel in front of you you can see two toyota second generation prius batteries that exploded while in the vehicle how is that even possible this one almost started a fire as you guys can see crazy huh well i was finally able to figure out what was happening and why this vehicle was blowing up the high voltage batteries this is a 2008 second generation toyota prius and these are reputed to be like some of the most reliable versions uh, of the Toyota Prius until the fifth generation of the Prius came out. Uh, so these are highly sought after. Uh, first generation was okay, uh, but the problem with the first generation of the Prius was that is that uh, not so many of them were ever made throughout uh, the run, the manufacturing run of the first generation. So the second generation is what really got the Prius on the map and really made it a popular vehicle and it has proven to be one of the most reliable and uh, awesome gas mileage vehicles you can get on the market. So what exactly happened for those batteries to be blowing up? Well, if you look, let's pop up open the trunk here I think it should be open if you look in the trunk on the right hand side you have the battery and there are some connections going to the positive terminal and within that uh, box attached to the positive terminal you can see there's a 5 amp fuse mine wasn't bad it was just corroded so i was looking through my wiring because i knew it had to be a wiring issue uh, of course you can see this is a third battery heavy uh high voltage battery pack that i'm using the first two blew because there was a bunch of corrosion where you have that five amp fuse and so i believe uh, the information that was supposed to be relayed to the inverter, which is under the hood, was not being uh, relayed anymore. So the inverter didn't know what exactly was going on back here. And the high voltage battery, the hybrid system uh, computer could not figure out exactly what was happening with the state of charge. So I think it defaulted and sent out a default amount of uh, power and the red triangle of death appeared on the dash and the next thing you know the battery was overheating the fan was running like crazy and by the time i stopped the pack was damaged so um, i've tested the vehicle uh, extensively and i think i'm still under the test regime right now uh, but that seems to have solved my problem uh, the codes I was getting initially was that I had to change the uh, battery pack and after that I had a module that was uh, over volting so it went to I think about uh, it was significantly higher compared to the rest of the modules and so I thought those two uh, those modules were bad I changed out two of them and of course that did not solve the problem I just fortuitously found this fuse and when I took it out to take a closer look it was completely corroded and so I changed it out and started the vehicle no triangle of death let it run for about 30 minutes uh, stopped let it rest started again no issues so I just have everything open here since I'm still testing the vehicle um, if you have a Prius that's chewing through batteries, <laughs> that might be the problem. Um, from what I understand, this single wire 
is what is hooked up to that 5 amp fuse and what it does is it runs all the way straight to the inverter and it tells it uh, I believe if you have everything hooked up correctly like the voltage that this is a positive signal meaning that uh, the 12 volt battery there is hooked up correctly and then the inverter can go ahead and perform its uh, function correctly um, for some reason I think something went wrong and that fuse was supposed to blow it did not and that caused a hell of a lot of problems I still have to clean up the vehicle but let's go ahead here and try to start it up so you guys can see it start as you guys can see it says it's ready just have to check my tire pressures it runs great So that's what I had to share with you guys. Um, I got the hybrid system uh, computer. Let's go to one. And this is buried all the way under the dash somewhere there. Close to the main engine computer. Uh, you have to take the dash completely apart. So I'm glad I didn't have to, to do that to get this uh, everything running correctly. One thing I like with the Prius, you know, it's put together very nicely like a, a Lego set. So you can take out, uh, you know, everything just pops out. And then when you're done, you push everything back in place and everything stays put. So that's what I had to share with you guys in case you're having your heavy duty battery exploding on you make sure you check that 5 amp fuse on the positive terminal of your 12, 12 volt battery that might be the cause uh, so now I have everything running let's see if we can back up here Everything is running just fine. Anyways, thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye now.